Hi, good morning and welcome to another video from Tech Tricks Info. Today we will be talking about Tesla's Dojo supercomputer and the D1 chip which is powering the supercomputer. Please watch the whole video and give your opinion in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel Tech Tricks Info, please subscribe to us. It will motivate our team to create more quality content. Today we are trying to answer these questions in the video why tesla is building their own supercomputer dojo what is the purpose of dojo supercomputer and why this computer is called dojo let's answer all these questions please watch the whole video so let's answer the first question why tesla is trying to build their own supercomputer dojo tesla actually plans to use this supercomputer to train their own neural networks to develop self-driving technology but tesla also have plans to make it available to other ai developers other artificial intelligence technology users or developers to use their technology in future in my opinion what tesla is trying to achieve here is to own almost all the technologies and patents by themselves which are required for the growth of the company so that they can drive their business without depending on any other companies the next question is what is the purpose of dojo supercomputer the dojo supercomputer will be used to train the artificial intelligence softwares which the tesla company uses in their tesla cars or tesla board so tesla board is another new product coming from tesla which is the tesla humanoid robot as per elon musk the dojo computer is capable of processing vast amount of data especially videos for their artificial intelligence learning purpose and the dojo supercomputer will be four times faster than any other systems currently available for doing this particular job the tesla cars which you can see running in our roads have a deep neural network system in it which is actually in a shadow mode which makes predictions while the car is driving without controlling the car these data which are obviously videos and images which are collected by the deep neural networks which are driving or operating in the shadow mode in these cars are used by the tesla engineers for training and learning purpose this will help them to identify the tough driving scenarios and make predictions according to that. This data is correlated and used by the deep neural networks to process over and over and over again until they can make predictions without making any mistakes which helps the car to drive in autopilot mode safely. This will help to train and learn the artificial intelligence softwares which will be used by Tesla cars or any other Tesla products which might use the artificial intelligence in the future. So next year the Tesla board prototype is going to come and it is also going to use the same technology the Tesla cars are using the same artificial intelligence technologies will be used by the Tesla bots to be functional. Artificial intelligence or AI help machines to mimic human behavior. For the success of artificial intelligence software, machine learning, neural network and deep learning is very crucial and for this supercomputers are very critical. So the Dojo supercomputer which is powered by the D1 chip just been unveiled in Tesla's artificial intelligence day will actually help to power this supercomputer. The Dojo supercomputer is supposed to be the world's best or the number one artificial intelligence training supercomputer and when you compare to the supercomputers in the world it is going to be the fifth most powerful supercomputer according to Elon Musk from Tesla. But when it comes to the specific tasks that Tesla is building the Dojo supercomputer for, it is very likely that Dojo will outperform all other supercomputers in the world combined for this purpose and the purpose is artificial intelligence training and development. Ganesh Venkataraman, senior director autopilot hardware has introduced this D1 chip on the artificial intelligence day at Tesla. As per Ganesh Venkataraman quote, this was entirely designed by Tesla team internally all the way from the architecture to its package. This chip is like GPU level computing with a CPU level flexibility and twice the network chip level IO bandwidth. Let's answer the third question. Why is it called Dojo? 
Dojo is a Japanese terminology for immersive learning. Tesla is going to use this supercomputer for immersive learning of artificial intelligence and development of it. And hence they have used the terminology Dojo. That's what I guess. We'll be making more videos on the Tesla technologies going forward. To support our team and motivate us, please subscribe to us. You can also get our videos, training and articles and technical support through WhatsApp please send us a message. Please see the description below for more details and also follow our other social media channels. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.